So let me go ahead and show you how to install Inventor Fusion 2013 as you see I have it installed over here and um, you might think it's kind of difficult but it's actually not. Um, if you go under the Autodesk website and you look for products, there is Inventor products, you go under how to buy, there is only Professional and LT 2013 and um, if you want to use Fusion you basically have to install AutoCAD 2013 because Inventor Fusion comes with AutoCAD 2013 it's included in the package you don't have to do anything and um, even if you look under the website Inventor Fusion get a bunch of links over here go into a forum but you can't really find the product by itself you have to get our get 2013 and uh, there is a link below you can click on the link and it's going to take you to a video which shows you how to install um, our cat for free legally with the serial key and everything so you can watch that video and see how to install inventor fusion uh, I mean AutoCAD and Inventor Fusion will come with AutoCAD you don't have to do anything it just downloads and installs on the site and um, let's start it up real fast just show you some what Fusion is uh, yeah my SSD is doing a great job so it's much much simpler to use than, than AutoCAD. It took me a long long time before I got used to AutoCAD and this is just I've used it just a couple of times and it's just so easy. Um, click on front, it starts sketching somewhere, let's make a clamp or something. Look at it, it just knows what you want to do and shows you all the dimensions. You can of course click anywhere else or apply your own dimensions but I'm just gonna keep everything simple see it stops you don't have to press escape or anything it knows that you wanna stop once you get there um, extrude it doesn't know that you want to extrude this part which I don't understand why ah, SolidWorks knows always what you want to extrude 70 and there you go and we can make a hole for a set screw for example on this side click on this circle or actually let's make it in the center from here see it, it stops the lines the, the line for you you I didn't press escape or enter see so easy it knows what uh, what you want to do click on the circle it knows you want to click in the circle. You don't, in our cat, you have to type in the numbers to, to be as precise as this. This thing is just easy and fast. You want to erase these lines and uh, click on the press pull, go down. Yeah, so yeah, this is what and uh, the cool, the really cool thing about this is that you can easily move one um, project from AutoCAD to Inventor and back and forth. And you want to do something in Inventor, but and then you want to do something else in AutoCAD, you can easily move them from one program to the other with just a click of a button. And uh, depending on which software is easier for the part that you're doing, so it's much much nicer to use this uh, program. Alright, thanks for watching.